coming up. Live coverage of this Tuesday night NBA game here on 2K Sports. This is Brian Anderson with Hall of Famers Grant Hill and Doris Burke. Allie LaForce, our reporter. It's the Chicago Bulls and the Chicago Bulls. And it's going to be the Bulls off the tip. And a look at the starters for the Bulls. Pass to Noah. And here's Gibson. Oh, they get a hand on it. Six to shoot. And so it looks like the Bulls will retain possession here. Just five to shoot. Here's Rose. And the sweet roll that time on the rim. That one falls. He's a producer. It's part of their plan to get him as many touches as possible. Here's Jordan. Count that bucket. Michael Just taking Jordan. it right to the rim. And no one was there to greet him. But I think defensively, that is not the way you want to start. Giving up high percentage looks, that doesn't typically end well. Here's Brewer. Pass to Gibson. Puts it up from 12. Missed it. Now 0 for 1 on this game. Boy, against so little defensive pressure, you have to convert that. Jordan. And there's the rejection. Boy, Gibson's so good at timing these rejections. Twice on the pipes from Taj. Here's Brewer. No good with a layup. First quarter and about a minute and a half in. Here's Harper, guarded by Rose. The basket drops, and he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. He's a taller guy for the one spot, and as we just saw, he gets that length to good use. One shot. with the ball. It's a three-point game. Now here's Rose. Tight defense on him. It's tipped. Pass to Pippen. The three ball. And it's Chicago with the board. They're searching for a way to score. Yeah, buckets have been very tough to come by. Here's Boozer. Here's Noah. Now here's Rose. Fires the three. And again, Chicago, no good. And he probably thought he was going to bury that one. Jordan with the bucket. Oh, what a mid-air adjustment. You know, he had to alter his release point, but didn't let it throw off the shot. Pass to Noah. Here's Rose. They need this. Longley with a rebound. Well, this has not been a quarter to remember for this guy. He looks completely flustered. Here's Harper. It doesn't go for him. Good D by Rose. Chicago trailing here. And in the first quarter, about three minutes played. Back to Gibson. That one no good. And it's Chicago the other way. Now Jordan. Pass to Longley. Unable to get that one. And first quarter, we're about three and a half minutes in. Here's Brewer. Rose outside. Here's Gibson. 
Pass to Boozer. 14 feet away. Longley with a rebound. He expects to make every one of those, and we expect him to make them too. To the paint. Robin. And he makes no mistake. Slam dunk. Oh, not the defensive effort they need to cut into the lead. For a good call, you have to at least try to protect the rim. For the They're just too slow to react. You can't afford to sleepwalk through possessions. What's going on out there? Timeout called here. Chicago decides to talk it over. That's a good timeout. They just can't hit anything. Sometimes it just feels like misses become contagious. He wants to settle his guys down right now. Here's Brewer. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Knocked loose. And they're on the run. Here's Pippen, who oh, trains the 19-footer. And guys, one thing that's triggered this run, their proficiency inside the three-point line. Pass to Boozer. Now Gibson to the left wing. Now here's Rose. Down to five on the shot clock. To the wing, right side. To stop the drought. He hits the back iron and sinks it. And here's Jordan. Pass to Harper. Just five on the clock. The fader. Chicago grabs the miss. I love how they've attacked the boards here in the first quarter. Here's Brewer, covered by Jordan. Shot's blocked! And the basket by Pippen. Boy, absolutely no rim protection, leading to a lot of easy buckets. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Rose can't connect. How many shots has he missed this quarter? Might be time to find offense elsewhere. Here's Harper. Beyond the arc. Noah grabs the board. Gibson with it. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Noah and the tip in on the offensive boards. That's second chance points, right? If you want to keep Joe Kim Noah off the glass, you better do your work early. Pass to Rodman. Here's Pippen. Here's Brewer. To the middle. Here's Gibson. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Jordan. The Bulls making a switch here. Bull substitution. Bill Weddington. Steve Kerr. And now let's revisit that exceptional mobile one block. <laughs> what a play. I mean, that'll have the offense thinking twice about taking shots in his presence. Hey, Boozer, Boozer, Boozer. Go up. Hey, go up. Off the inbound. The putback. Great positioning on the putback. <laughs> That's great work on the glass. That kind of hustle play can energize your team. Here's Pippen. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. Man, the defender really went after him. Second team foul. At the line for the Bulls, Scotty Pippen. Two shots.
free throw, no good. And the Bulls making a change here. Second free throw, no good. Pass to Jordan. Shoots a fadeaway. And that one off the back of the rim and in. Jordan's got his third bucket of the night. Chicago with the ball. They trail by seven. Here's Brewer. Here's Boozer. Rose right side. Oh, big finish. Oh, did you see that? Boom, he jams it straight down. Now, it's the aggressiveness of Derrick Rose, a guy who is relentless when he wants to attack, trying to bend your will to his. His shot was hindered by that momentous mobile one block. Yeah, good offense comes from great defense. This lead is only getting stronger with plays like that. Here's Kukoc. Pass to Kerr from outside the arc, and that's good. His first bucket of the game. He's consistent from out there, especially when you give him that kind of room. Knocks it loose. Oh, it's stolen by Jordan. And a fast break now for the Bulls. Shots good by Kukoc. And now it's a 10-point Bulls lead. Defensively, their effort hasn't been great early on. Pass to Gibson. Here's Boozer. Rose, left side. Banked it in off the glass. Rose has got six. Boy, what a warrior Derrick Rose is. Guy gets buckets. Through contact out there, so tough. To the inside. Here's Jordan. And slam dunk by Jordan. Man, that was fast. They're already up by double digits. Wow, they've come out strong. Control the pace, assert their will. Nice. They get it again. That's a big time Kim throwback. Noah. Throw down by Joe Kim Noah. Go to work, big man. Inside. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. That's his second. The officials were right on top of that. Team foul. And guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown for the Bulls. They set the first half tone by getting out on the fast break and getting defenders on their heels. Yeah, and I think the other thing that's helped them early tonight are the points they've gotten off turnovers. First one falls for him. The Bulls making a switch here. Jones has checked in. Also good, so he hits both free throws. Here's Brewer. Pass to Jones. Out to the right wing. And it's Rose penetrating. Good on the bucket. Give him eight. When you come off the screen that hard and that fast, so difficult to stay with Derrick Rose. Now a timeout called by Chicago. All right, look who's coming out of the court. Get up and get down for Brown. He's checked in for Jones. Give him a hand, fans. Your lovable dance team. Pass to Kerr. Here's Pippen, defended by Brown. Down low. Here's Pippen. And Brewer pulls it down. Inside. Two minutes remaining in the first. Two minutes. Out to the right wing. No good on the three. Boy, what a nightmare quarter for this guy. He's playing right into the hands of the defense at this point. 
And he lobs it up. And slam dunk by Jordan. They're not wasting any time putting their stamp on this game. What a start. And they've been doing it largely at the offensive end. If the defense does not adjust, this could be a blowout. Pass to Brown. Here's Noah. Here's Rose. The rebound by Kukoc. Oh, an easy look, but he decides to be a crowd pleaser. I'm sure he's upset for attempting that one. Uses the glass on the layup. And the Bulls lead by 12. They've been very effective so far. A balanced attack at its best. On the offensive end, it feels like they're getting the shots they want. And defensively, they are connected and on a string. Now here's Rose. Give him eight. Pass to Brewer. Four on the clock. Over Jordan. The Bulls with another miss. Well, this guy cannot get started. And the offense overall has been a struggle because of it. He's off on that one. And Chicago will go the other way with it. Brown inside. Here's Brewer. This one for three. Doesn't go that time. This has not been his best quarter. And you know what? They keep calling his number, and they're simply trying to get him out of this funk. Here's Kerr, guarded by Rose. Here's Jordan. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Fourth two foul. At the line for the Bulls, Michael Jordan. Taking two shots. The first one falls. So both teams changing it up here. And he makes both free throws. And as we conclude the first quarter, a one-sided game so far. Bulls out in front. They lead by 14. And we'll bring you to start of quarter number two when we return. It's been a lopsided game. We'll see if that changes here in the second. And a comfortable margin for the Bulls here, guys. Give it up for their D. They're battling, communicating, and coming up with key stops. Yeah, I think they wanted to come out of the gate strong, and they have. They've taken the early lead here. On the court right now, second quarter for the Bulls. Here's Kukoc. Pass to Jordan. To the paint. Here's Pippen. And he caught that pass in full stride on his way to the big slam. The B.A., when he gets the rim in his sights, it's tough to stop. So aggressive and a determined finisher. Nice. And it's out of bounds. Still Chicago's ball. The main Chicago ball. Rose outside. Pass to Noah. Here's Boozer. And the jumper from down low is true. Well, how about the vision of Joe Kim Noah wastes no time delivering that pass? Here's Kukoc. about a minute gone in the second quarter and down it goes two points he has six 
and force feeding the ball inside. I mean, no reason to go away from what's working. Pass to Rose. Tries to break his ice. And the layup is good. Well, that's about effort, carving space for the interior look. And one attribute we'll always talk about with Rose is the heart that he plays with. Here's Kukoc. That was a good call. The defense wasn't established. First team foul. Coming onto the floor for the Bulls, Luke Longley. We're about a minute and a half into the second quarter now. To the inside. Here's Kerr. He can't get it to go. Now Chicago takes it the other way. Now Rose. He's got 10. To the middle. And the basket by Joe Noah. Noah. Now listen, physical play is not going to deter Joe Kim Noah. He can apply as much punishment as he absorbs. And here in the second, two minutes gone by. And it's rejected. Here's Rose. High quality look as he sinks it. Rose has gotten four this quarter. That's ten straight points they've given up in the painted area. Huh. Pass to Kukoc. Here's Pippen. Clock at six. Inside. Here's Simpkins. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. And the defense has no one to blame but themselves. I mean, they just let him get right to the rim. To me, this has simply stated been a complete lack of defensive attention and focus all night long. Now here's Gibson. Now quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. Pass to Boozer. At the line for the Bulls, Carlos Boozer. Taking two shots. Shooting two. And he knocks down the first one. He's perfect from the line this time. Now for those joining us now, we're in the second quarter, about three minutes gone by. Here's Pippen. Give him eight points now. Pass to Rodman. Here's Bushler. Here's Harper. Going inside. And that one's good. He's got five. And he's just crushing them with plays like that. I mean, just continuing to pile it on. You want to make sure your opponent knows they have absolutely zero chance of a comeback. And nice finish by him. Blocked! in midair and converts the double clutch layup. Oh, and the athleticism he showed there? Wow. That's not easy to do. Here's Brewer. Pass to Gibson. Here's Boozer. Here's Rose. And that one is stopped right through. B.A., forget about attempting the long-range three to cut into that lead. Just attack the rim, my man. Man, that was sweet. Here's Pippen. And that bucket makes him four for seven today. Good production.
and, and just not letting up at all. I mean, you have to love this approach. You want to get the ball to the guys who make plays. One thing we've learned in the NBA, the game is never over. So you've got to continue to score, continue to build your lead. Here's Gibson. Harper pulls it in. And at this point, they're loving this big lead. Absolutely. And they haven't really faced a lot of resistance. Pass to Rodman. Here's Harper. Blocked! Well, this is a guy who has great wingspan and has an ability to get to shots others can't. Here's Pippen. And again, it's Chicago with a three. Adds to their lead. They've been able to rely on him all night. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. I think Derrick Rose is feared as a driver of the basketball. But boy, that three-point shot has come a long way. Here's Pippen. 13 points in the game. And just a great screen. And they got a high-powered finish out of it. And my question is, where was the help? Someone rotate over and challenge. Here's Brewer. Longley with a rebound. Smooth sailing for Chicago. Here's Harper. to Longley. Chicago grabs the miss. Despite the defensive presence, he challenges at the rim. Give him an A for effort. Gibson down low. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Gibson's got his first bucket in this one. They didn't do themselves any favors with their shooting in the first quarter, but they're starting to pick it up now. Here's Bushler. Pass to Pippen. Five on the clock. Here's Longley. Got a piece of it. Rose outside. Here's Noah. Give him eight. Here's Brewer. Three-pointer. And that doesn't go. He's an ice-cold one for nine from the field. I'll tell you, you hate to pin this on one person, but his inefficiencies at the Ron offensive Barber. end are holding this group back. Ooh, he has a lot of tools in the toolkit. That right there was just one of them. And it's good. Two, Two points. Noah. Ten points for him. Boy, this guy has Time been terrific. The, the rest of the team, however, struggling. Timeout called here. Chicago decides to talk it over. I don't think this timeout is just to give the guys a breather. Coach is looking to switch things up. And as you know, it's what comes after that gives you some sense of what has changed. Here's Harper. Nine points in the game. Into the lane. Good. Five for nine shooting so far. This is what we call highly efficient play. Working off the screen, getting to the cup. Pass to Gibson. Here's Boozer. Rose, left side. They get the rebound. And Boozer gets it to go. Well, a tough first quarter for this guy. You like to see the shot go in. Nicely done. The Bulls on offense. They lead by 14. Now here's Jordan. He's got 12. Fades away. And Chicago again with a bucket. Jordan's gone 6 of 8. Rose outside. On the take. Tipped. Here's Harper. Guarded by Rose. Harper misses. 
That's the shot you hope for right at the rim. Just couldn't capitalize. To the paint. Here's Noah. Picked his pocket. And a fast break now for the Bulls. Here's Jordan. Rose grabs the board. Analytics already don't favor the mid-range jumper, let alone against exceptional defense. Ooh, rejected by Jordan. They get it back. Boozer. They had a number of cracks at it. Just came away empty-handed. Right wing. To the inside. Cuts off the pass. And here's Gibson. Rose right side. Back to Gibson. Six on the shot clock. Second chance effort. And he sinks the layup. Gibson's got his second bucket on the night. Well, Taj Gibson is so strong on the backboard. His ability to pursue the offensive glass is truly a thing to watch. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Here's Jordan. That one's good. Seven for Michael ten now. Jordan. That's been the story of their offense so far. Getting a number of looks from point-blank range. Rose with it. He's got 17. Vision by Rose, right? Hits the open man. He's creating for others. And this guy is so tough to time deal out, with. And the Bulls call time here. And as we head into this break, the players have an opportunity to replenish their energy with Gatorade as they prepare to go into the final stages of this ballgame. Absolutely. Over the course of a game, not to mention over the course of a season, you have to stay hydrated. If you don't, it's amazing how much slower your body is to bounce back. It can have a serious effect on performance, no question. The Bulls making a switch here. Bulls on D. It's a 14-point game. Here's Kukoc. He has six. Misses that one. Three for four from the floor. Got the ball where he wanted it, but then got swarmed. Pass to Brewer. Here's Boozer. Here's Noah. The shot is good, and the assist by Rose. He's got 14. They just look so overwhelmed inside. You know, that's why they continue to get attacked. Here's Kerr. Now Jordan. And we're going to have a go, jump go, go, ball. Go, 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 go. You two players. And it's the Bulls with the ball. Shot clock at six. And he's going for the lob. Can't hit that one. Now Chicago takes it the other way. Pass to Brewer. Ooh, a little luck that time as it drops. Well, the big man, Taj Gibson, pretty assist there. So it's Chicago now. 17 points was their biggest margin. Nine seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. Here's Kerr. Right side. Here's Rodman. Five to shoot. Here's Jordan. Rebound by the Bulls. Now here's Rose. And there's the slam. Dunk to finish it off. Now, B.A., you know they would love for him to get more of those opportunities. Well, that would cut into the deficit quickly if he does. That'll do it for the first half. It's the Bulls. They lead by eight. We'll see you after halftime for the beginning of the third quarter. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Greetings to each and every one of you watching at this very moment. Uh, I'm Ernie Johnson. Kenny the Jet Smith is here. Shaq is here. One half is behind us. Welcome to the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Chicago holding the upper hand after the first two quarters. They have an eight-point lead. How about you, Shaq? What did you think about Chicago? They're running some great offense right now, working the ball in good spots, taking what the defense gives them, now forcing them shots. We'll see if they can maintain that discipline in the second half. And Kenny, let's get your input on the Bulls. 
The free throw margin is very telling. One team is playing aggressively, getting to the line, and the other one just this. You got to be willing to play for the contact. And that's a wrap for our halftime show. The third quarter just about to get started. And we played through the first half. Plenty of basketball left in this one. Boy, you look at Derrick Rose. What a contribution. Slicing up the defense, living in the lane. Terrific first half for him. His penetration was a real problem for them. And then, of course, the monster finishes at the cup. Here's Jordan. Pass to Pippen. Down low. Here's Longley. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. Even with the score as it is, he just keeps coming at you. And for Chicago. Rose outside. Here's Noah. Pass to Brewer. Six to shoot. The Bulls need to get off a shot. And Boozer gets it to go. They're playing great team basketball. It's good movement and sharp, crisp passing. Jordan with it. And slammed up by Jordan. You can see why they go to this guy so often. More often than not, he's going to be very efficient like he is right here. Pass to Rose. And they recover it. Here's Noah. Here's Brewer. Shot clock at five. Here's Boozer. Harper pulls it in. Takes it inside. Inside. Here's Rodman. Lays it up and banks it in. And it's a 12-point Bulls lead. Wow, what a start to this half. Three for three, dictating the pace on the offensive end. They're rolling early. Pass to Boozer. Over to the wing. Here's Rose. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. I'll tell you, if he's feeling right physically, Rose will battle you every step of the way. That's a fierce-looking drive. At for Chicago, Derrick Rose. Two shots. Two, two. No good on that one. Good on the second one. Well, an interesting thing about Derrick Rose, right? Over his career, he's been an up-and-down jump shooter, but he's been remarkably consistent from the free-throw line. Here's Pippen. 15 points in the game. And the lob disrupted. Not to be. To the paint. They swipe it. A little under two and a half minutes gone by in the third quarter. That one's good. Seven for ten now. Their defense just falls apart once the ball goes inside. Here's Brewer. Pass to Boozer. To the right side. Here's Rose. And a nice finish on the layup. Rose has got 22 points. Another one for Derrick Rose. This is a flashback to when he used to do this on a nightly basis. Here's Pippen. Pass to Harper. 
Here's Longley. Clock at six. Here's Pippen. And it's going to be a 24-second violation. They turn it over. An outstanding defensive play to earn the mobile one block. You know, you can't ask for any better defense than that. He responded so fast to the shooter, and it stifled him. This gives him an opportunity to get within 10. Rose outside. We've gone about three and a half minutes here into the third. Here's Brewer. And the deficit down inside single digits. He's got six. Well, defensively, to me, you've got to do a better job communicating once the screen comes. To the inside. Longley, that's good. Longley. And talk about imposing your will. That's ten straight points in the paint. Here's Brewer, covered by Jordan. And here's Gibson. Here's Brewer. Somehow scores the layup in traffic. Here's Pippen. They've got a nine-point lead. Pass to Jordan. Here's Rodman. Back to Jordan. Five on the clock. Here's Pippen. Misses the three. Used the pump fake well, but he couldn't capitalize. On the attack, Rose. Oh, and he brings it down with a two-handed jam. Yeah, he's still showing flashes of that incredible athleticism. Rose is a force attacking the lane. Jordan high post. 18 points for him. Here's Harper. There's the drive. He can't hit that time. And it's Chicago the other way. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. Chicago trailing here. Rose outside. To the middle. Here's Gibson. And he goes up strong with a one-handed jam. They've been aggressive during this run, but they've also played under control. I think the communication on offense is working at every level right now. What a run for this group. Now here's Jordan. Oh, he pipes it. Nine for 14 and showing no let up. What a great shooting performance. His percentage is outstanding. Pass to Boozer. Out to the right wing. Rose with it. 24 points for him. They closed the gap over the last few possessions. But can they push through and grab the lead? Yeah, it feels like they've ramped up their intensity. They have forced good things to happen. Now they're back in it. Here's Rodman. It's a five-point game. Deflected! And a fast break now for the Bulls. Pass to Brewer. Inside. Here's Gibson. No good. Now Chicago takes it the other way. 17 points was their biggest margin. Who poked away. Now Rose. Back to Gibson. Can't connect from short range. This guy just can't find his rhythm. And you look up at the scoreboard, they absolutely need his productivity. And the basket by Pippen. Well, after Three. netting one in the first half, that's the second deep ball to go down for this guy. Now here's Rose. Tightly guarded. It's deflected. Pass to Pippen. Here's Longley. Jordan with it. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Harper. And he tries it off the glass, but it's no good. 
boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. Brewer. The three-pointer off the mark. Chicago leading. Here's Pippen. And they're going to count that bucket, and they'll send him to the line. It could be a three-point play. Yeah, this period, they're letting him go to work, and it's paying off. All right, guys, some stats here. The scoring breakdown for the Bulls. I really thought maybe they'd cool off a bit at halftime, but they've continued to bury those jump shots. Now, the other thing they've done tonight is work the ball into the paint. Plenty of their points coming from close range. Here's Brewer. Give him eight. And that one drops for him. He's got ten. Good job attacking. Those restricted area shots are what every NBA team is looking for. Pass to Kukoc. Gets to the rim for two with the D all over him. And the Bulls lead by 11. Here's Brewer. Ten points for him. Here's Boozer. Right wing. Rose right side. Chicago grabs the miss. Yeah, he tried to gain position, but couldn't quite get there. The Bulls making a switch here. Bulls substitution, Dennis Rodman. Here's Jordan. 20 points for him. Right at the free throw line and off the left side of the rim and swirls in for him. Jordan's got 22 points. And he couldn't get an easier shot. The defense right now just looks defeated. Well, simply stated, simply not enough effort. Not enough attention to detail. They've gotten run over this evening. And here's Chicago. They're on a 12-4 run. And the Bulls get it back. Rodman, no good. Now Gibson, six points for him. Pass to Brewer. Now here's Rose. The Bulls with another miss. Well, he hasn't proven to be much of a floor spacer for them. He had Two the one three, but that was back in the first half. Two minutes. Driving inside. Here's Kukoc. Boozer grabs the board. They've got plenty of time to get back into this. Yeah, I'm sure they feel pressed, but this is when you have to stay calm and execute. Well, you combine Gibson. size, aggression, and toughness, and you get Taj Gibson. My goodness, nicely done. Pass to Kukoc. And here's Jordan. And a bit of a battle for the ball. And the officials signal a jump ball here. And it's the Bulls with the ball. And they'd love to cut this deficit down to single digits. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. Here's Rose. Got a hand on it. A minute four left to play in the third quarter of basketball. Kept alive. Pass to Kukoc. Here's Kerr. Off target with the three. Now here's Gibson. Defense right on him. Rose outside. And down it goes. Jam that one home. And a solid pick to free him up for the dunk. Boy, the timing there couldn't be any better. Uh, the execution was simply flawless. That, ladies and gentlemen, is how you run that play. Now here's Jordan. 
The Bulls with another miss. Listen, simply put, he's got to finish that. It's not like the defender was right on top of him. Shot clock and game clock. One second differential. Now here's Rose. And he's got 28 now. Clock at four. Let's the three fly. Hits a three-pointer. Rose has got 12 points in just the second half. He really hooked the defender with that pump fake. It worked to perfection. And so it's Chicago leading by six as we wrap up the quarter. And it's mostly due to their superb shooting. They've wasted very few possessions. We'll be right back with you shortly. And we take a listen in now to Tom Thibodeau on a recent huddle. You guys got to read the ball better. Save this man. Read the ball. All pressure. Everybody talking. Oh. And when the defense is lacking, Coach Thibodeau will definitely let you know about it. Yeah, he doesn't hold back at all. And his players respect him for it. He really wants them to improve their effort. Well, this has been a great contest so far. I imagine the fourth quarter could have more action in store for us. Now here's Rose. To the inside. Noah. Good work there as he goes. Well, working off the pick, you see Rose attracting attention and hits the roller in stride. And for Chicago, let's take a look. Jordan inside. Here's Kerr. Sinks the tray. Boy, that's just great passing out of the double team. They had him bottled up, but he manages to create an easy basket out of all that pressure. Here's Brewer. Pass to Gibson. Here's Noah. Out left to the wing. Here's Rose. Whoa! Whoa. And that one is hammered home. Oh, I love this guy. Even when they're trailing, he works hard to put on a show. Hey, that might be just what they need right now. Let's take another look at the staunch defense during that mobile one block. Oh, showing no signs of giving up this lead. That block sends shockwaves into the opposition sails. That one goes. Count it. 25 points in the game. Absolutely ruthless. He's not about to start showing mercy now. Well, when it's closing time, he's trying to lock the door. He's been going all night. Now here's Gibson. To the paint. Here's Boozer. Good setup. Let him to the rack perfectly for the layup. That gives him a double-double in this one. Pass to Kukoc. Down low. Here's Kerr. That one goes in. And the Bulls lead by seven. What an excellent post-entry pass. Good things happen when you make that next look. Now here's Gibson. Over to the left wing. Here's Rose. Another shot. And he lays it up and in. Rose has got 16 points here in the second half. You gotta love how they've been crashing the boards, fighting hard for every miss. Jordan with the bucket. How about the timing? Could be the difference between an assist and a turnover. Nice delivery. Rose outside. Pass to Boozer. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. At the line for Chicago, Carlos Boozer. At the line for two. two shots. And the first one at the line is good. on both. Timeout called here. Chicago decides to talk it over. Adjustments are a part of every game in every quarter of a game. I think Coach sees something here. Well, this is a chess match. Looking ahead a few moves and trying to execute toward that. All right, 
let's check in with Allie LaForce. I was able to listen in on what Chicago's coach was going over with his team. He said to his players, you may want to get comfortable with this lead, but we can't afford that. That's when we get into trouble. Just keep executing the game plan and trust in one another. Okay, good stuff. Thank you, Allie. And wrestling for it there, but no one has possession. We'll have a jump ball. So it's Chicago now. Chicago leading. Here's Rose. To the wing, right side. Here's Brewer. Pass to Gibson. Here's Noah. Just five on the clock. Here's Rose. Oh, and that one, no question, powered it down. And you have to love it. The floor general taking things into his own hands. Just the aggression they're looking for, man. Boy, and not just the aggression, the ability to get to the rim, but how about the finish with intention? Oh. Here's Brewer, following the bucket by the Bulls. Rose outside. Here's Noah, and he dunks it down. Okay, Joe Kim Noah doing work tonight with a variety of offensive skills. Jordan with it. With the teardrop. Yep, that one's good. Jordan's got six points in the quarter. He's been red hot. It's like one of those days when it seems like he can't miss. And his shooting is the only reason this game is as close as it is. He's been Mr. Reliable offensively. Here's Noah. And this is a big man with a lot of craftiness to his game. Joe Kim Noah being aggressive draws the foul. Second team foul. At the line for Chicago, Joe Kim Noah, two shots. Two, two. First free throw is good. You know, part of what you love about Joe Kim Noah is his leadership ability. He inspires his teammates to raise their level with the way he plays. It's both from the strike. <laughs> They've been playing with much greater physicality this half. Getting themselves to the free throw line is a bust. Pass to Kukoc. Here's Jordan. Laid it in with a nice Michael touch off the window. Jordan's got 14 points now in the second half. Well, you love that they've been able to rely on him time and time again. You love the effort here late. Here's Brewer. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That's his first personal foul. Third team foul. At the line for Chicago, taking two shots. The first free throw is good. And so he hits both. Chicago with the ball. 17 points was their biggest margin. And there's the foul. It'll go on Derek Rose. That's foul number two for him. Second personal foul. First team foul. Pass to Kukoc. To the inside. And the layup is good after a nice lead pass. And the Bulls lead by five. Soft defense. I mean, they've given up 10 of the last 12 points inside. 
Here's Boozer. To the left side wing. Here's Rose. Soft touch off the glass. Rose has got 39. He's shooting the lights out down the stretch, trying to keep them competitive. Pass to Harper. Here's Kukoc. Shoots over Gibson. Kukoc, no good. Rose outside. Here's Brewer. Tries again. And the layup is up and in. And it's now just a one-point Bulls lead. You cannot take Noah for granted in there. A veteran who will make the right play. Pass to Rodman. Here's Kukoc. 13 feet out. Six on the shot clock. And that one comes up a bit short. Now Gibson. To take the lead. And that's two points on the layup. It matters not if you have a hand up in contest. Todd Gibson feels like he can score now on the low post. Pass to Kukoc. Here's Rodman. Jordan with it. Here's Kukoc. From downtown. Boozer grabs the board. From deep throws. And again, it's Chicago with a three. Well, they're just riding the hot hand down the stretch, and he's been in the zone all night. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Pass to Jordan. Here's Harper. Can they get it? Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. That's his second personal foul. Second team foul. Shooting for Chicago. Ron Harper. Two shots. And he drops the first. the second so he hits one of two you wonder what the score would be if they weren't controlling the glass to the wing on the left the ball's knocked loose here's Jordan here's Rodman and that one's good a nice Rodman. job on the glass as they picked up two on the second effort it's winning time and that's a winning play time called here the Bulls decide to talk it over it's now an opportunity to take a break and talk about their strategy moving forward. Well, there's something that the coach doesn't like. I'm curious to see which kind of adjustment he makes here. And now we present our New Balance Player of the Game. It's almost beyond belief what he's done in this game. He's been impossible to cool off, hitting just about everything he looks at. It doesn't matter who's guarding him. He's had an answer for just about everyone. to shoot. Here's Rose. There's the drive. Yes, it's good. Rose has got 13 points in this quarter. I'll tell you, this guy still plays with a star's mentality. A strong drive. 
five converts against physical, physical defense. I just love the aggressive finish. Now, I'm thinking he's sending a strong message with that jam. So it's Chicago now. The Bulls making their last shot. Brewer can't hit. I'll tell you, he's trying to help them extend this lead, but it's been a tough night for him individually. Here he goes. Harper. Oh, no good. Had a chance to take the lead. Chicago leading. Rose outside. Now here's Jordan. Pass to Harper. And here's Jordan. Here's Harper. Just five to shoot to take the lead. Second chance shot. That gives him the lead. And the Bulls lead by one. He got in excellent position, then takes it right back up. Here's Brewer, covered by Jordan, and the basket by Noah. And they've really relied on him down the stretch. Now here's Jordan. Defense is right there. And he gets it to go from the high post. Jordan's got 34. And this is the definition of a clutch player. He's six for seven in the quarter as they try to pull this game out. Pass to Gibson. Here's Boozer to the middle. Here's Noah. And down it goes. Dumped it through off a beautiful setup. That's a huge bucket. Noah ready to take on the challenge as the atmosphere tightens. Two minutes remaining in the game. Here's Pippen. Here's Harper. That three's off the mark. A minute 53 left in the fourth quarter. Pass to Boozer, to the wing on the left. Now Gibson, covered by Jordan. Rose outside. There's the block. Here's Harper. Out to the right wing. Now here's Jordan. He's guarded closely. And the ball is tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. Here are the Bulls now. Chicago trailing here. And the shot goes. Tight ball game coming down the stretch. Yeah, with seven lead changes thus far, this has been a thriller. Rose outside. To the paint. Here's Boozer. Deflected. 102 left in the game. Here's Harper. Inside. Here's Jordan. Money. Big time shot. Sending his teammates into a frenzy. I'll tell you, these guys have worked so hard together. Everyone pulling in the same direction. Beautiful to watch. Now a timeout called by Chicago. They're behind by three. 52 seconds left in the fourth quarter. There's 49 seconds left in the fourth quarter. On the attack, Rose. Oh, it's blocked. It deflects off the backboard. And a pass break now for the Bulls. Here's Harper. To the wing, right side. Here's Jordan. Yeah! Timeout time called. The Bulls. Time out They're down the by five. 29 seconds left to play in the fourth. Ladies and gentlemen, the Lovables. Twenty-nine seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Here's Rose. It falls. Rose. What a beautiful shot! Brings it within three. That is unbelievable. One of the best big shot makers this game has ever seen. 13 foul. And it's the Bulls with the ball. 
17 points was their biggest margin. And a smart choice right there. I mean, you can't allow them to just drain the clock. Shooting for Chicago, Ron Harper at the line for two. the first one and that gives him a four point cushion and so he drops them both and it's a five point game showing great confidence from the line that makes this a two possession game there's 21 seconds left in the final quarter here's Rose and he sinks it. What a beautiful shot. Brings him within three. Well, the floater has always been a key shot in Derrick Rose's arsenal. And the later he gets in his career, the more we may see him deploy it. At the line for the Bulls, Michael Jordan. Shoot two. Taking two shots. He drops the first one, and that gives him a four-point cushion. And so both free throws good, and it's a five-point game. Well, you love a guy who gets himself to the line, takes his time, and makes the free throws. Complete professional. Let's it go from deep. Brewer can't hit. And he's doing things on the glass tonight that we don't often see. His production has been unbelievable. A testament to how much he cares about his craft. Shooting for Chicago. Ron Harper. Two shots. Oh, take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Ooh, he doesn't hit the first. That was the one they really wanted. He's got one more, though. And he ends up making the second. And that increases the lead to six. Gibson with it. Let's go with a three. Misses there. So the Bulls win it. And they barely squeezed out the win here on the road. And B.A., the visiting team is always under some added pressure. But they made it work and got the win, whatever the margin may have been. And that'll do it, folks. For Ali LaForce, Doris Burke, and Grant Hill, this is Brian Anderson alongside our 2K Sports crew thanking you for watching. So long and good night, everyone.